Papa. Yeah. On stage with the brew in his hands. Mama. That's their so shit. He's staying rude to the fans. Mama. Grabbing the steps, look at him, doing it again, mama. Man, that's that Devin, man. I was just banging to that throwback shit, man. Devin the dude, that is. Not that Devin Haney, because the only reason why I ain't came on here and said nothing after the fight was because, honestly, I ain't watched that shit live. Um, I got about a million phone calls, though. I, I watched it. I, I seen I watched it yesterday or last night. Devin boy. Mm, mm, mm. You did all this motherfucking talking, and you look like some shit. I swear to God, that was the boringest motherfucking fight ever. I don't know why people paid their money to see that shit. You did all this motherfucking rapping. Your father ain't know what the fuck to really tell you in the corner. You know what I'm saying? Like, get the fuck out of here, shorty. Y'all knew what y'all was doing by sending that bullshit ass term sheet over. Because if you would have sent some correct shit, I would have I put you over my knee, y'all, and then spanked that ass. I would have spanked that ass the way your daddy's supposed to or should have. Because uh, that, that, that shit that you did last night, I mean, uh, Saturday, with Gamboa, that shit was re fucking ridiculous, man. That shit was ridiculous. You know that that was unfucking satisfactory to what you gave to, your, to yourself. And to the motherfucking fans. Ain't nobody want to see that boring ass shit. And it was so funny because the, commenta <laughs> the commentators was trying to talk about something. But they couldn't find shit to talk about. One of the commentators said some shit like. Either Devin Haney don't hit hard. Or Gamboa. Maybe Gamboa. Uh, he grew a chin. What the fuck type of shit is that? Stop this shit man. Man. Y'all know what time it is, man. Y'all see why the fuck these fighters running. Devin don't want no motherfucking parts of Mr. Gary Russell Jr. Nor does Tank Davis. They don't want no motherfucking parts of me. Nor does motherfucker Terrence Crawford. Yeah, I'm still on Terrence ass. He try to get quiet, act like a motherfucker supposed to think, forgot about him. Nah, I'm, st I'm still on Terrence. I'm still on Terrence, but it's, it's, it's cool. I deal with him when I see him. You know what I'm saying? I'm a real face-to-face -face type person. So I'm pretty sure I run. We'll we'll cross each other's paths at some point. You know what I'm saying? But Devin, that shit was unsatisfactory. You look like some shit. You look like a motherfucking. I'm gonna tell you what you look like, cause I'm a real fighter. A lot of these fans they don't understand and they just go with the flow of shit. They go with who's ever popular. They don't go off of talent and skill. But you look like a motherfucking uh professional amateur. You were like a professional amateur, shorty. That shit that you was doing last the, uh, uh, Saturday, that shit would never fly with a Mr. Gary Russell Jr. You know it. Floyd know it. Your father know it. What's the fuck? Uh, I can't think of his name, man. Fake one to be coaching you now. Used to be fighter. He know it. I can't think of his name. But yeah, Leo Duck for years. Tank Duck for years. I'm going to tell you, I'm, I'm going to let y'all in on a little trivia. I've been world champion longer than these two motherfuckers have even been f professional boxers. That shit matters. That's intelligence. You know what I'm saying? That's skill. That's wit. You know what I'm saying? That's tenacity. These motherfuckers don't match the shit that I bring in that square. Come on, man. Hey, Devin. Hey. Y'all was smart as a motherfucker. Y'all was smart as shit. I swear to God, y'all was smart. Because what they did, y'all, was sent me a bullshit-ass term sheet that was ridiculous that anybody in their right mind would have never signed that shit. But the way that this shit looks out, I should have signed that, John, just to beat his motherfucking ass because that shit was crazy. That shit was crazy in the motherfucker, but I'm a real man, and I don't like the way that his father did some little, said some shit. When I wasn't on camera and I heard he was being real disrespectful, you know, and out of pocket when it came to my father, you know, that shit not cool. You know what I'm saying? It's certain people you don't want rattling in this world, man. I'm one of them people. But, um, yeah, shorty, you dodged the bullets now. You dodged the bullet, though, shorty. I swear to God, you look like some straight shit. You look like some shit. And, and Gamboa wasn't even doing nothing. 
He wasn't even doing nothing. Your father was lost in the corner. Your father is not a fucking trainer. He is not a fucking coach. He is not a coach. What you think that your athleticism is going to continue to get you over your career? Negative, dog. You need some you need some real shit with you. You need that you need that X factor shit that you don't got, Shorty. Use a good amateur. Use use a professional amateur. That's it. That's all. Jump in that motherfucking water with me. You're going to get eaten alive, man. It's real shocks out this motherfucker. Y'all y'all perpetrating. But yeah, man. That's that's why I ain't been on this junk child, man. That's why I, that's why I ain't been on here, man. I ain't watched that shit. But that's too many people been calling me, talking shit, saying talking about how Devin looked like some shit. You know what I'm saying? Bill Haney not no fucking trainer. He's not a coach. I mean, he's a motherfucking Bill Haney is a a low budget pimp. He pimping the, the bitches with bullet holes in their ass or something like that and scuff marks and and and, and a used car salesman. You know what I'm saying? He trying to spin that shit to the media. To try to win some fans over something. I don't know. But your son don't got the goods. He don't got that it factor. I tell you that much. And the best thing you can do is keep him the fuck away from me. Tank. Everybody already know I want you. You know what I'm saying? Everybody know I want you, man. That shit. Cr- and then. you Tank and Devin. Y'all was going back. I seen how y'all was going back and forth. Talking about who make the most money. And who cars paid for and who's not. Both of y'all need to shut the fuck up. Y'all sound like two little ass fucking kids. Like y'all are. Going back and forth bickering over some shit that's fucking irrelevant. How about y'all bicker over who the fuck gonna get in the ring first and take this ass with him from me? How about that? Uh, other than that, all that shit y'all talking, going back and forth with each other, y'all like some suckers. Both of y'all need to shut the fuck up. Yeah, straight like that. And if you feel some type of way when you see me in person, I mean, you know what it is. We we all competitors. We all warriors. Well, I'm a warrior. You know what I'm saying? So if y'all feel some type of way, when y'all see me, you know what I'm saying, then approach me. But if not, then shut the fuck up. You know what I'm saying? Sign the contract or something because y'all niggas looking like some shit. Y'all looking real sweet. Y'all looking real sweet. But I'm going to get on here, man. I got some other shit to do. I'm going to get back in the gym. You know what I'm saying? Go put me a little road work in. Crank my dev and the dude back up, my throwback shit. Just wanted to holler at y'all and let y'all know. Give you give y'all my thoughts on the Devin Haney fight. Because that shit was fucking ridiculous. So I'ma holler at y'all, man. Stay tuned.